Hello my friends, my name is Irvin, also known as Kobelman. In this video, I will show you how to upgrade to a solid state drive or additional hard drive on uh, HP G1 or G2 desktop small form factor PC. This will be a huge upgrade to all kinds of things that we might be doing when it comes to video editing or even gaming, especially if we upgrade to solid state drive. Link in the description box below if you're interested in that type of product. Hello guys, my name is Irvin, also known as Kobelman. In today's video, we're going to upgrade or add a second hard drive to our HP 800 G1 or G2 type of computer. So with the computer facing down, we're just going to open the lid. If you just pull the lever up, up like so, you can lift it up like this, put it aside. And here's our access to our hard drive. The way you do this is actually you pull the lever if you're going to replace this one and then pull it towards yourself and then lift up. Let me show you a little bit better, better, better angle of this. This whole contraption can be actually lifted like this. There's no button or anything like that. But here's the lever that's holding our hard drive in. So if we want to remove that, this is what I do. I usually just put it down like this and then I pull towards yourself, right? Pull towards yourself and then gently lift up, right? Once you once it's released from the clip, you can gent gently lift it up and then you can disconnect these. These are very self-explanatory. You just pull them in and out and you replace them and then you put it in. And then after this, after I put this back in, you just have to be gentle when you do it. I will also add a second hard drive in there and show you how that's done, whether it's a solid state or something similar of size or one of these regular three and a half inch ones. So once you put it in, you just do this basically the same thing in reverse. You push it down gently and then you push it away from yourself. Okay, now let's look what we have underneath. If we go like this, we can see that we have space for our solid state drive right here. So if we want to use something of that, this is actually a laptop um, drive, but it's the same size as our solid state. So if we want to install it here, we can certainly do so. We have extra connector here that we can use. And then once we're done, we will basically connect our connector here. And with the new hard drive, we will get an extra serial connector, which goes right here, serial cable. We would connect this like so, right? And then we can use our connector here to connect the second hard drive like so. I'm trying to get a good angle for you guys here. Like that, like this, like this, okay? And now we can just you know mount it, or you can mount it ahead of time, it's all up to you. And that's how we can install our solid state, or even if you want to, if you choose just to have an extra hard drive laying around. So you just have to make sure the notches are aligned properly. And you can see, just take your time whenever you install any of these. Let me just move this a little bit back here so you guys can see a little bit better. Here's, we can put another full size solid state drive. So if, you, if these things are in your way, you can simply disconnect. This is just our front CD-ROM, right? We're just gonna disconnect these here just to make space. Okay, again, we have an extra power connector here. Put it in like so. Anyways, I'm just using an old hard drive as an example, but once you put it in there and you, you, know, you have it screwed in and everything like that and it snaps in, you would basically connect the connectors like so. You got another power connector here, and then you got this extra serial cable that you can use. All right guys, if you're interested in other videos that are related to upgrading RAM or the video card for this specific computer, I also have that, look for it. At the end of the video, there will be a thumbnail you can click on, also in the description box below. Thank you so much guys. If you're interested in a solid state drive, they'll go really good with this. There will be a link in the description box below as well. Thank you so much, like, share, and tell friends about it. Have a good day, bye 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 bye.